And within the last hour, Vice President Kamala Harris hitting the campaign trail with her new vice presidential running mate, Minnesota Governor Tim Walls. The two appeared together at a rally in Philadelphia today. Walls is a former high school teacher, congressman and military veteran. The choice signaling that Harris has intention to appeal to Midwestern voters. And CBS's Skylar Henry has the latest now on how Trump's v VP pick, J.D. Vance, is reacting. Hi, this is Tim. It's Kamala Harris. Good morning, Governor. Vice President Kamala Harris's campaign released a video purportedly showing her call to Minnesota Governor Tim Walz, asking him to be a running mate. I would be honored, Madam Vice President. Uh, the joy that you're bringing back to the country, the enthusiasm that's out there, uh, it will be a privilege to take this with you across the country. The two traveled to Philadelphia ahead of their first campaign rally together. Why pick Tim Walz? A source close to Harris says she picked Walls because of his record as governor and in Congress. The Army National Guard veteran worked as a high school teacher before his political career. Harris is counting on Walls to take the fight to the Trump campaign. He was the first to call former President Trump and running mate J.D. Vance weird. Well, we're not afraid of weird people. We we're a little bit creeped out, but we're not afraid. While the Harris campaign is looking for Walls to broaden the ticket's appeal to moderates and independents, Vance responded for the Trump campaign, pinning Harris and Waltz is too liberal. Tim Waltz's record is a joke. He's been one of the most far left radicals in the entire United States government at any level. Vance was also campaigning in Philadelphia Tuesday ahead of the Harris rally with Walls. We know that there are six or seven states that are going to decide this election, so I'm going to go to every single battleground state that I can. Harris and Walls plan to campaign in six other battleground states following tonight's rally in Pennsylvania. And the Harris campaign says it raised more than $10 million just in the first six hours after that announcement of Walls as the VP pick.